Samsung decided to use its own Exynos chip again for the Galaxy S24 phones, which made many people worried. Last year, they only used Snapdragon chips for the Galaxy S23, and people like that. This year, Samsung is using both Exynos and Snapdragon chips for the Galaxy S24 and S24 Plus, but the Galaxy S24 Ultra will only have Snapdragon chips everywhere. There are rumors suggesting that Samsung might use only Exynos chips for the Galaxy S25 next year. They're said to be making big improvements to the Exynos chip, and the Galaxy S25 could show off these changes. However, it seems like Samsung might not go all in with Exynos just yet. Earlier rumors have raised hopes that Samsung could exclusively use the new Exynos 2500 chip for the Galaxy S25 series. This chip is rumored to be significantly improved compared to previous versions, with Samsung even establishing a separate team to optimize it for their next high-end phones. Recent reports have indicated that Samsung has made significant efforts to enhance the optimization and efficiency of the Exynos 2500 chip, addressing areas where its performance has historically fallen behind Qualcomm's Snapdragon chips. However, the latest updates suggest that Samsung plans to stick with the usual split between Exynos and Snapdragon chips for its flagship lineup next year, maintaining the status quo. Although it hasn't been officially confirmed, there's a strong possibility that the Snapdragon 8 Gen 4 chipset will be exclusive to the Galaxy S25 Ultra model. Other models in the lineup are expected to feature a combination of Snapdragon and Exynos 2500 chipsets. The estimated cost of $200 per unit for the Snapdragon 8 Gen 3, combined with hints from a Qualcomm executive suggesting that the Snapdragon 8 Gen 4 will be their priciest system on chip yet, presents a challenge for Samsung in terms of maintaining profit margins if they exclusively use a single chip. By introducing their own Exynos 2400 and later the Exynos 2500, Samsung has an opportunity to sustain a healthy profit flow while still offering hardware upgrades without compromise. As we anticipate more rumors, especially regarding the Galaxy S25 series, there will likely be further updates to come. Stay tuned for more information as it unfolds. I hope you enjoyed watching the video. If you liked it, consider subscribing to the channel. It would mean a lot. That wraps up today's content. Share your thoughts in the comment section below. As always, stay tuned for the next video. Take care and see you next time. Peace out.